Welcome to Webstyle Press. Do you want to install React 19 and try it right now? You can install React Next, React Experimental, React Beta, or any version of React JS using this method and try it right now. Here is how. Open git bash or terminal, npm init dash y or minus y. Use npm init command to create package.json file. Clear. Then we can install React and React DOM. npm install React React dash DOM. This is the command to install React and React DOM packages. But if you want to use a beta or experimental version of React, specify it like this: React at next React dash DOM at next. Enter. Next React nineteen. Then install Webpack, WebCLI, Babel, and necessary loaders and plugins. So in this command, we have got Webpack, Webpack, CLI, Babel loader, Babel core, Babel preset, and Babel preset react, HTML Webpack plugin, Webpack, and dev server. Hit enter. Done. Now create a .babel rc file in the root of your project, that is this one, with this configuration. Presets add Babel slash preset env. At Babel, preset React, save. This configures Babel to transpile modern JavaScript and JSX. Similarly, add the root, create new file, name it webpack.config.js. Use this code. It will require HTML webpack plugin, and it defines paths for our entry point and index files, src slash index.js, src slash index.html. Save. Now open package.json file. You see the versions here. Versions for React and React DOM. It is 19. And here we have our scripts. Replace the scripts with this configuration to simplify running and building the app. Save. Now here, new folder, src. Create src folder. Inside src folder, index.js file. And also create index.html file. For index.js file, write app logic like here is this counter. State is being used here. And these are the buttons to increment or decrement the counter. And then for index.html, use div with the ID root. And that's it. Now we can run this app by using command npm start. So this is our app and clear. npm start increment decrement so here is the react js app running and using latest react js version 19 now is this the best way to do it or is it the best configuration absolutely not this is just an inspiration and for sure not the only way to do it the best code will come from you that will be according to your custom needs as well so try it and let us know how can we further improve this okay i hope it helped like share subscribe and i will see you in the next one